Welcome to episode 13 of Space Insight, a series by Spazio Show. Today, we will look into SpaceX's new Starship impl- interplanetary rocket venture. According to SpaceX, Starship is a proposed fully reusable two-stage to orbit super heavy lift launch vehicle that aims to take humans to Mars before 2030. The rocket is still in development and more than 11 prototypes have been tested so far. Engine development for the rocket started back in 2012. The first prototypes made low altitude, low velocity flight testing of vertical launches and landings in 2019 and 2020. Now let's jump over to components. All test rockets have a 9 meter or 30 feet diameter stainless steel hull. The other main component is the Raptor engine as you can see on screen. The Raptor engine is a reusable metal ox staged combustion engine. Raptor engines began flight testing on the Starship prototype rockets in July 2019, becoming the first full flow staged combustion rocket engine ever flown. It has a diameter of 1.3 meters or 4 feet, a height of 3.1 meters or 10.2 feet, and a thrust of 2 millinewtons or 440 kilopound force. Let's head over to the uses of SpaceX Starship and its possible future applications. According to SpaceX, the Starship is, in, it is intended to become the primary SpaceX orbital vehicle. They intend to eventually replace their existing Falcon 9 and SpaceX 2 Dragon fleet with Starship, which is expected to take cargo to orbit at far lower costs than any other existing launch vehicle. Starship is designed to both deliver cargo and people to and from the ISS. Starship's fairing half provides significant capacity for in-space activities, while the aft cargo containers can also host a variety of payloads. It also intends to help set up bases to support future space exploration. This includes SpaceX lunar exploration plans and the Martian ambitions by Elon Musk. He hopes to set up a Mars base using Starships by the year 2024. Next, we'll head over to the prototype testing progress. All of the tests till the uploading of this video have taken place at the SpaceX test site at Boca Chica in Texas. This probably will be the case until a more advanced base can be constructed for real missions, which may or may not contain humans on them. The actual testing of the prototypes began with Starship SN5 or serial number 5. The previous tests were of the proposed crew module for the rocket, also known as Starhopper, as you can see on screen. The SN5 test was conducted on 4th August 2020 for a duration of 45 seconds. The test was a complete success with a good liftoff, flight and landing. The SN6 test was conducted on 3rd September 2020 and yielded the same results. Both these rockets reached a maximum altitude of 150 meters or 490 feet as you can see in the stills on screen. The other four tests conducted were SN8 on December 9th 2020. SN9 on February 2nd, 2021, SN10 on 3rd March 2021, and SN11 on 30th March 2021. They were all failed missions despite reaching the intended highest altitude, ranging from 10.5 km to 12 km. The reasons were these missions were because of the rapid unscheduled disassemblies of SN8, 9, and 11. SN10, on the other hand, was a post landing explosion. Thank you for watching this video. The sources for the specifications and timeline of the program are Wikipedia and SpaceX's website. Don't forget to like, share and subscribe. Thank you.